Evil. Hello, and once again, welcome back to Resident Evil, this time for part five. You can see in the background, Richard is recovering, sleeping... Well, he's not sleeping, actually, is he? <laughs> Maybe this is a problem with the HD version, but you can see if you look at his head that his eyes are still open. Whatever. Anyway, he's resting, let's put it that way. He's recovering after his, uh, his snake bite ordeal. Right, what I want to do in this video is I want to go check if Rebecca has finished practicing with the piano. Hopefully she has, because I think we're just waiting for her to be done. So, um, let's, let's go through here. This is probably the quickest way back. Alrighty. Anyone getting up today? No? Yep, but shit. That's okay. I'll go the long way around. <laughs> it's fine. All these shortcuts, I don't need them. Although I kind of do. You know what? I actually don't hear anyone playing the piano, so maybe she's done. Or dead. Preferably done. Chris! Chris! You done it? I think I got it. Yay! Practice makes perfect. <laughs> All right. Yes. To be honest, I remember the painting moving rather than the damn wall, but I guess this will do. Right. Nothing back here. Nothing to lock onto. Not yet, anyway. Oh, uh, hang on. Something down here. Trevor's diary. Eleven days have passed since arriving on this estate. How did I end up like this? A guy in a lab coat brought me a meager plate of food and said, Sorry to put you through this, but it's for security reasons. That's when it hit me. It all makes sense now. There are only two people that know the secret of this mansion. Suspenser and myself. If they kill me, Suspenser will be the only person that knows the secret. But for what purpose? It doesn't matter now. It's too dangerous here. My family. I hope they're all right. I've decided to escape. Jessica, Lisa, I pray you're safe. How could I be so careless? I lost my favourite lighter. The one Jessica gave me for my birthday. Now it's going to be that much harder to escape this dark place. Uh, November the 13th, the date when my fate was sealed. My aunt was hospitalised just three days before that. Jessica and Lisa said that they were going to visit her. I wish I could be there with them. But wait, even as I'm writing, my memory is coming back to me more vividly. Just before I passed out, I remember the men in the lab coats said something like, Most likely your family is already... I pray for their safety. Somehow I managed to get out of that room, but getting out of this mansion won't be as easy. I have to get past all the booby traps. Tiger eyes, gold emblem... I have to try and remember for my own sake. Right. Gold emblem, yes. This being the gold emblem. And this, I think, should sit atop the fireplace. So yeah, I'm gonna take that. Fuck, no I'm not. <laughs> I will be taking that though, after I go find that wooden one. One that isn't worth anything. Yeah, okay. There's a lot of stuff like this in this game, where you have to replace things, otherwise you get trapped or killed, you know? The shotgun, the... The key, yeah. It's a theme. Alright, so... Shit, I'm gonna have to go past that crimson head, aren't I? It's alright, I came prepared. Yeah, if I just go get that wooden emblem, then I could swap that for the gold one and take the gold one and put it above the fireplace. It's as simple as that. <laughs> Ooh. I'll save the ammo! Yeah! Okay. I'll, I'll get you on the way back. <laughs> How's that? Or maybe I can dodge him again. That'd be good. Maybe at this point I should just be walking around with a shotgun. Just as a default. I don't know. Not the worst idea in the world, is it? 
Right. So, I did actually get the emblem. So it should be in here somewhere. There it is. With the, uh, the other masks. Still looking for one of those, of course. Yeah. I suppose if I didn't want to deal with the Crimson Head, I could go up the stairs, and then around, and then down in the main hall, and then... Yeah, it's not worth it. Let's just kill this guy. Or dodge him. There he comes. <laughs> two for two. Not bad. Uh, we'll probably have to do it a third time, though, won't we? <laughs> oh, no, maybe we won't, actually, because after I find the emblem, I don't need to go back through there. I can just go down the corridor and go through the door to the right. The camera right. Right. She's still around? You got anything to say? She has a look of concern in her eyes. Well, I'm not surprised. I've had a concerned look in my eyes for fucking ages. Right. Not a problem. Pretty much looks the same, weighs the same, slots in the same. So, there you go. So... For some reason, I want to look on the backs of these emblems, you know? But nothing. Nothing. And there's nothing odd about it, nothing unusual. That's what the wooden one said. Okay. Alright, well, simple enough. I know what to do with this. And now I can actually leave. Great. I'll, um... I'll leave Rebecca to her concern, I suppose. So, I believe this is actually going to lead us to getting the fourth mask. Let's see. Nice. Oh! Oh, right. I had actually forgotten about those. So it's really all based off the painting. And the two have run each other through, the path to your destiny will open, yes. I can turn the gears inside the clock, yes. I think I will. Turn which gear, the small one or the large one? Small? Left or right? Uh, right. Let's see if I can do this from memory. Yeah. The small one. Right again. No. That's not right. It's the other way around, isn't it? I'm trying to do this without, like, looking at the clues. I don't know why, but, uh, yeah, keep turning it. Small one. Turn it left. Get it back up there. I think it's the short one that goes at the bottom, isn't it? Yeah. So large, and then left twice, I guess. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> it's as simple as that. Right, will you take the mansion key? I absolutely will. Which one is it? Oh, really? The shield? The shield? That's a strange one. Yeah, okay, uh, hang on. Whereabouts was that? The shield door. Oh, yeah, I remember. Yeah, um, well, back where we rescued Richard, right? Oh, yeah, okay, back where we rescued Richard. That's a bit of a bugger, actually. Okay, I think I know what's coming up. Right. Let's get over there, but maybe I want to visit a save room on the way. Or maybe I don't. I'm not sure.
What is this? It's, on, it's easy mode, right? Easy mode, don't need to worry. Let's just go straight there. And uh, <laughs> hopefully I don't regret it. So the door on the right, yep, this one here. Did I deal with the zombie that was around here? I think I did, didn't I? Ah. I got room. Yeah. Not exactly picking up a first aid spray, but it'll do. Probably. Right, so it's the door. Oh, fuck! Straight ahead of me. Not another one. Uh, yep. No further use for the key. Great. Discard. Yep. Go! <sighs> Rock in a hard place, really. <laughs> okay. So. Let's see. Good so far. Not for long. That is a pretty big snake. Okay, right, yes. Um, don't really want to end up like Richard, so... Oh, fuck. Oh! Ah, shit, you bit me. Oh, okay. Maybe this was a dumb, dumb move. Poisoned. Oh. Poisoned. I need a serum. But I gave it away, of course. Oh, God, I don't know what the fuck's going on now. Okay, there's obviously a better way to dodge this guy. No, 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 no. Am I out of... Okay, I've still got one. Shit, okay. Just run over here. I can see the mask in the background. That's what I really want. Oh, fuck. Right, yeah, I don't have too much time. I need to get back to where I started, I think. Yeah, take it, take it, why not? Yeah, that didn't go as planned. It's easy to dodge him, I don't know why the fuck I didn't. Uh... Shit. Yeah. I actually... I actually don't know. Oh no. Poison. I think if I... Oh. I need serum. Serum? I remember seeing it. I'll be right back. Just hang in there. Are we... Do we play as Rebecca? Is that right? Yeah. Yeah, we're going back there for Chris. Okay, that's... That's pretty neat. I don't remember doing this exactly. So hang on, what's she got? Just a handgun and a first... Okay, well that's... That's cool. Huh. Cool. <laughs> this, is, this is a nice surprise. I think if you don't get bitten by the snake at all, if you don't get poisoned, you don't have to do this, but I'm kind of glad that I got bitten now, because this is kind of neat. Still, a a again, I think we've got some sort of time limit. It's not shown, but it's probably another four or five minutes or something, so let's get a move on. Oh, shit! Uh, okay, I'm going to have to try and dodge that crimson head another <laughs> two times, I think. Or I can just fuck him up. I guess I could just fuck him up. Right, come on, come on. Right, she's in. Go. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's it. Three for three now. <laughs> uh, yeah. Also, I think if you don't save Richard, you don't actually use the serum with him. You've got the serum still with you. Or you can have. So, Rebecca doesn't need to run off to get another one. You can just use the one that you failed to use on Richard. Anyway, there you go. Will I take the serum? Absolutely. I want Chris to live. Also, can... 
No, oh, shit, it's not the time. I was going to dump off the first aid spray. Because, to be honest, we don't play as Rebecca too much. And if she gets hurt, well, it's not the worst thing in the world. All right, let's see if I can sort of juke this guy a little bit. I did it with Chris earlier, so... <laughs> All right. <laughs> I think I'm doing pretty well with that one specifically. I mean, the snake I got fucked up by, but okay. I've still got time. I should still have time. And there was one of those fast crimson head zombies around here as well, so I've got to try and avoid him too. Just in time. How are you feeling? What happened? You were bitten by a poisonous snake and fell unconscious. E easy. Oh, my head's killing me. You should be fine, because I gave you a shot of serum. But again, don't do anything... That you wouldn't do? I'll try to remember that. I owe you one. You really do. Where did that crimson head go? Probably shouldn't question it. This is a, a nice blessing. So, I'm, I'm fine. Okay. And I've got the final mask as well, so... Interesting. Yeah, 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 okay. Well, anything else? Any last words? Oh, thank God I made it in time. Just a slight Mona Lisa smile and a nod. Okay. <laughs> no hug, no embrace, nothing like that. No thank you so much or anything like that. There's still work to be done. Okay, so... I suppose I could probably just take the mask that I've got down straight away. And then I'll bring the other two with me with a load of ammo. Make sure I reload the shotgun. Maybe bring some shotgun shells with me, too. Hmm. Yeah. Let's do it that way. I like the blood on the camera lens. That's a nice touch. <laughs> yeah. So, let's get this reloaded. Maybe bring in a few extras. And I'll come back with a couple of masks. How does that sound? <laughs> Don't worry, mate. You'll get one of us someday. Just not today. <laughs> I actually like him being in the corridor. It, it just... I don't know. Keeps me alert. It's not too big a challenge. I think I've sort of got his number. Yeah. <laughs> just making sure I'm paying attention. All right, let's play uh, inventory Tetris a little bit. Oh, she's back. Are you okay? Want me to treat your wounds? Do I have any? I mean, yeah. Sure, why not? Thanks. I guess I had a little one? She probably just cured cancer or something. Thanks. Uh, yeah, right, so... This is where it gets interesting, because I don't exactly know what... I want to bring with me as such. Maybe I don't even bring the handgun, right? Maybe I just... Yeah, screw it. You know what? There you go. That can go over there. I think that's probably enough. Probably. I'm, yeah, I'm not sure, actually, now I think about it. Um, definitely bringing the masks, of course. Tell you what, yeah, let's bring the handgun. Not the magazine, because I want a slot for picking up stuff, but, uh, yeah. That looks good to me. So, there you go. That's my default weapon at the moment, and I won't go to the handgun unless I absolutely need to. Alright, let's go. Very surprised that zombie still hasn't gotten up. I think if it was normal mode or hard mode, he'd have been up like the first time I saw him. Here we go again, come on. For the sixth time. 
<laughs> he keeps getting closer. He's learning, I think, but it's just... It's not good enough. Not yet. <laughs> Alright, hopefully I'm not underprepared. I don't have any health items, but Rebecca has very kindly healed all my wounds, so... Unless I fuck up like I did when I was with the snake, I should be okay. Let's see. So, Mask Without Eyes, that's going to be the one on the very left, so... There you go, the perfect fit. And then there's this one. Okay. Slowly, Chris, slowly. I remember this is like a boss of sorts, I just don't remember what the boss is. Wait, we got... I think there's shotgun shells down there. Okay, it's like a crimson egg of sorts. Oh, nice. Tell you what. Use this time to shoot him again. <laughs> oh, fuck. Right. Uh, want to get those shells, really? They are shells, aren't they? Yes. Yes, please, thank you. Really? If I had a knife, I'd stab you. Well, I, I don't have a knife, but I do have a handgun. I think he's done for. There's nothing on the body or anything? No, I'm looking at the mask. Okay, uh... That was actually easier than I remember it, but that, I guess that kind of makes sense, because I'm on the wrong difficulty, but, uh... Yeah. It's not just a switch, though, right? Yeah, there's something here. Will I take the stone and metal object? Oh, yeah. Yes, I will. Nothing else there. Right. Let's have a look at this stone and metal object. I think I know where this goes, but... I'm pretty sure I didn't actually show you guys where this goes. I got very close, though. Nothing unusual on the back. Carved on the octagonal object. Yes. Let's get out of here. Yeah. Yeah, that wasn't such a big deal. Um, if you remember, actually, if I just take a quick look at the map. Yeah. Sort of the top right where the arrows are going off map. That locked door, that red door, I think, it goes in there somewhere. Where that dog tried to jump me. So, okay. I think the next move is I go to the top right save room. Let's go do that. Maybe this is it. Maybe this is going to be the time where he gets up. Or maybe not. No, he's just going to forever tease me. Again, just like the other one outside the save room. Playing the long con. Well, I'll tell you what, yeah, I'm going to pick this up because it's right there. Why not? We are kind of wrapping up the mansion segment, I think. There's still the helmet key to find, though. So maybe not quite yet. Anyway, yeah, uh, a little bit of inventory Tetris, and I'll be right back with you. Okay, so again, keeping six shells in the shotgun, but I'm not bringing any spares. Got the handgun, got the ammo, and this stone and metal object. So I think we're good to go, really. And I'm still fine, remarkably. Even after that boss fight, got slashed a couple times, but yeah, I'm fine. Is this the day where it falls apart? No, not yet. Not yet. Okay, so, uh, no, not through there. Through here. That's it. There is still that dog out there. I didn't finish him off, so, you know what? Let's go back to the shotgun briefly. Oh, fuck! <laughs> what? Did you just... Did you just feed him a flash grenade? Hang on. Whoa! Holy shit, you just blew him up! 
Well, it saves me some ammo, I suppose. <laughs> All right, yeah. Right, so this is the bit that I didn't really get to show you guys. Over here, an octagonal indentation. The defiler of the accursed coffin. Well, obviously, it's this. And that, in turn, unlocks this door, I believe. Yeah. Okay. Really? We've got some stuff around here as well? Okay, well, uh... Maybe not right now. I don't know. I'm just looking... Yeah, maybe I could run some of it back to the save room, but not now. Not now. So, do we go this way or the other way? Maybe this way. Okay. This is Brad. Oh. Come in, Stars Alpha team. Come in. Does anybody hear me? This is Chris. This is Brad. Stars Alpha team. Bravo team. It doesn't matter. Respond. I repeat, this is Br Brad. This is Chris. Brad. Damn. Things broken. That Richard, that good for nothing son of a bitch. He gave me a bad radio. Oh, shit, okay, <laughs> there's a dog in front of me. This time, I just want to shoot it. Oh, shit, okay. Yep, get another flash grenade in his mouth, and run. Fucking run. <laughs> That's kind of cool. That really is. I didn't think you could use them with, uh, with dogs. So we got one of those, two of the two of the daggers. Let's go back to the daggers. All right. Well, at least I dealt with the dogs, right? They're not coming back. Hopefully. Uh, this is a new one as well. We got a couple of herbs down here. This one's blue. Interesting. Now I know combining the green and red herbs actually gives you a slightly better healing item. Combining green with blue is that for poison or something? I I actually don't remember. But there you go, another herb. I know where it is. I'll, I'll come and collect it if I need it. Straight ahead then, is it? Okay. At a certain point, we're going to run into a locked door, I think. Maybe not quite yet. Oh. Chris can't swim, can he? Or at least he doesn't want to. Yeah, here we go. There's a square-shaped hole here. So I need to find something with a square shape to put in it. And that is probably going to be... Elsewhere. <laughs> it's not in the courtyard area. Or at least not this part of the courtyard area. So I can't... I can't use the ladder. I... Nope. He doesn't even want to think about it. That's fine. Hmm. Yeah. There was another door where that first aid spray and the shotgun shells were. I think that's the door I want to use, really. Ah. Can I use this? No? Uh, there's no button or switch around here? Hmm. I think it's elsewhere. Okay, yeah. Let's head through here now. Yeah, I'll get it at some point. I'm just leaving so much behind. I will get it though, eventually. Probably. <laughs> Okay. Again. Looks clear. Ah, the signpost. Oh, this is kind of important, isn't it? Right. Some kind of signpost. Each direction is accompanied by a corresponding destination. North is the Valley of Destruction. South is the Cave of Hatred. East, the Summit of Madness. And West, the Path of Revenge. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I mean, that's about as cliche as you can get, right? Uh... 
There's a switch here. Uh, yeah. Right. I probably will, but not yet. Not until I really find out what the hell I'm doing. I'm spinning a statue of Cerberus around, but... Wesker? You mean the place I'm going? Okay. Monster in chains, eh? Do not resist. Okay. Down here? Yep. Oh yeah, we got another one as well. Um, no. Not yet. Here we go, though. This is what I was changing. Um, I guess it was this one I was looking at in the cutscene? Yeah, that's the one. A statue with red eyes. The inscription reads... The war cry of revenge. So we've got the red and the blue uh, weather vanes. And revenge. Uh, probably should have written this down, actually. I think that was the last one, which was west. So I think you need to head west. And this one over here, with blue eyes. This inscription reads, The Last Gasps of Destruction. Alright, so let's see. The guard dog's desires are fulfilled. Yeah, so we need to turn them in the right direction, otherwise we're not getting through. Simple enough, though. Simple enough. Okay, uh, I just want to go and check the signpost. Make sure I know what's what. So, north is destruction. Uh-huh, okay. So, we actually want blue to face north. And then revenge is at the bottom there, so we want that to face west. Alright. Starting with red, then. Please. Okay, so I want you to face west. There you go. There you go. <laughs> it does slow down occasionally. And that's it. Simple as that. Go on, then. Don't you fucking dare. <laughs> I hate crows. And they gang up on you. Oh, okay. So we can go straight on, which I think we do need to do. Or we can go to the right. Um... Let's take a sneaky peek to the right, shall we? Oh, is this where the wind crest goes? I think I've got one of these. Two vertical lines across and three horizontal lines. Could it be some kind of... Yeah. Or is it this one? Something written in the indentation. When the wind sweeps across the earth, stars... Right, that's the one. That's the one there. Okay. And what about these two graves? Can we have a look? No? Alright. Okay, time to go. Before I... Yeah, I just agitated them. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I wish I brought the windcrest with me now, but there's, there's gonna be, there's gonna be time for that. Right. Yeah. That sounded like a chain to me. Yeah, a long, windy path up the hill. Come on. A couple of statues on the way. Standing silently in the darkness, but that's it. Okay, yeah, there's a building at the very top here. <laughs> so many camera angles. Here we are then. Right, can we go around the back here? Yeah, uh, nope. <laughs> a couple of green herbs, is that all we get to play with? I guess so. Um, maybe I'll take one inside, just to be safe.
I vaguely remember this bit. Looks like it's all okay at the moment. Is there something to pick up here? Some nothing standing out as an item, you know? Not yet. Oh, oh, that, that's a map. Yeah, a map of the courtyard. Great. Yeah. Okay. So that leads around to there. Sure, that's when I deal with the uh, the water issue. Okay. Wait, so what is this is a save area? With a family picture, okay. Uh, oh right, there's a journal left by someone as well. Uh, Daddy attached for or attacked first, probably mum attacked second. Inside red and slimy, white and hard. Not true, mum where? Dunno dad, found mum again. When attacked mummy, she moved no more. She's screaming. Why? Just want to be with her. Mum, where? I miss you. Uh-huh. Oh, I see. That's a good view of the door. Might need to use that at some point, actually. Ah, yes. I was looking for this, actually. So, um, if this has the wind crest in it, which it should... Somewhere. There it is. <laughs> Just for a moment, I thought I got rid of it. Um, yeah, I'm going to take that out and... Maybe put this down there. Let's get something a little meatier, shall we? First aid spray. And let's bring out some shotgun shells to reload that shotgun. Yeah, so... Put that back. That's okay. That's that's a nice arrangement I think you got there. Still nothing. Oh, not for long though, look. That's it, right? The crank. With a square-shaped peg at the very end, I think. I believe. I don't need to do anything else with it. No, no, that's it. That's... That's what's going to help me out with that water situation. I'll get rid of the crank in due course, I suppose. I'm just going to I'm going to leave it like that. So, ah, yes, fuck. Okay. This may be what Wesker was talking about. I didn't die, right? I didn't die. No. Just for a moment, I thought I'd have to do all that again. Oh, damn. Did you write that note? Fuck, fuck, fuck. Right, I'm fairly sure you can't kill this thing. Um... Do we go down or something? No? Uh, okay. Maybe I could... Oh, actually, you know what? I might be sort of exploiting the game engine here, but if I just stand here, I might be okay. Can you climb down? Great, I'm going up. <laughs> oh, fuck, okay, it's alright. You're punching me in the right direction. I want to go this way. I want to get the fuck out of here. Yeah, you can bitch and moan all you like. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Through here. Yes. <sighs> she didn't lock the door. <laughs> right. Um. Ah, oh, damn. I. Fuck. I, I want to use the. I want to use the herb, not the spray. But I can't drop it. I don't want to go back inside and you know do more inventory Tetris. You just hit me more. Uh. Wait, what? <laughs> Down here, right? Yeah. Whoa! Hello. Go around you. Uh, <laughs> We've got some visitors. Ooh, another one? No. Okay. All right. It might be crows that I'm dealing with now. So back to the handgun because the shotgun for the crows is a bit excessive. Right. 
does it. I'm just going to walk by them. I think it's a proximity thing. Like, if you brush up against them, they get pissed. Or maybe it's if you run or something. I'm not sure. Anyway, this should go here. And it does. All right. So, oh wait, this is going to be a problem, isn't it? This is going to be a major problem, because I can't pick them all up. Uh, well, I guess I could do it one, one at a time, right? But even if I do that, I might not even have enough space to collect what I think I want to collect. So, maybe I'll come back to this a little later on. But it's it's nice to get the wind crest out of the way, I suppose. Right, uh, slowly again. Come on. I think we're good. We're good. All right. So yeah, back to where I killed those dogs through the gate. Use the crank, and then we'll see where that takes us. Yeah. Ah, right. It's not just the first aid spray. There's also yeah, a flash grenade hiding away there, hiding behind it. Yeah, nice. Still nothing here. Nothing protecting where I have to use the crank. No. Not at the moment. Okay. It fits. Okay. Hear the sound of a waterfall in the distance, yeah. Well, all that water's got to go somewhere, I suppose, right? Anyway, yeah. Now I don't even have to get my feet wet. Nothing down here? No? Uh, probably. <laughs> Let's not linger! Alright. So, now to the other side. This... This is going well! Ah, oh, here we go. Hopefully this isn't like a one-way trip kind of thing, because I did want to go back and get all those herbs and the items from the gravestones and... Yeah, shit. Alright, slowly does it, slowly does it. Alright, so that's the waterfall, I think, that I heard. It's a raging waterfall at the moment. It looks like there's something beyond it, but at the moment, it's just too much to go through. Yeah, I can take that. Quickly now, before the crows realise what you're doing. I'm fine. Great. So, where can we go from here? Well, there's that locked sort of elevator thing that's over here in this direction. Oh, shit. Fuck. Okay, I shouldn't have done that. Uh, the power to the elevator isn't turned on. There's got to be a power source somewhere. Well, yeah, I can see the problem. It's right here. The battery's been taken out, so we need to find some sort of battery. Okay. Um, but behind me, there is that, that door that I can go through, so let's go. Fuck you! <laughs> All good? Red herb down there, I think. Yep, cool. Oh, and snakes! Yes! Great! Ah! Fuck. <laughs> Easier to deal with than the big one, in some ways. Can I go through here? Oh, I can! Wow. Sure. Alright. Again, I don't think I'm locking onto anything. I don't hear anything. Where are we? Re oh, the residence. Okay, yeah, that's what it's called. So we got loads and loads of blue herbs, whatever they might do. This should be unlocked, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. Another place to save. Do we have any... Ah, ink ribbons, yes! I will this time, actually, because I do want to save. And what about... And there's the box as well to dump all the excess stuff. Okay, yeah, um... 
Again, I'm going to do a little bit of inventory Tetris, and this is where I'm going to end the video. I suppose next time we'll explore the residence, what we can of it at least, and perhaps go back to the mansion to collect herbs and to the graveyard to do a little bit of puzzling. We'll see how it goes. Either way, thanks for watching. See you next time. Anyone getting up today? No? Yeah, but shit. So yeah, I'm going to take that. Fuck, no, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> two for two. Well, back where we rescued Richard, right? Oh, yeah, okay. Back where we rescued Richard. No further use for the key. Great. Discard. Yep. Go! Oh, okay. Maybe this was a dumb, dumb move. Poisoned. Oh. Poisoned. All right, go. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's it. Three for three now. Also, can... Oh, shit. It's not the time. I was going to dump off the first aid spray. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Don't worry, mate. You'll get one of us someday. <laughs> he keeps getting closer. He's learning, I think. Maybe this is it. Maybe this is going to be the time where he gets up. Or maybe not. No, he's just going to forever tease me. Oh, fuck. <laughs> you mean the place I'm going? There it is. <laughs> just for a moment, I thought I got rid of it. Ah, yes, fuck, okay. Can you climb down? Great, I'm going up. <laughs> oh shit, fuck. Okay, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs>